welcome this is Solak here again back for a lovely mini reading about your power animal cards for today so whenever you come this across please tune in and enjoy this short but enlightening I hope <laughs> reading for you let's see what spirit has in store for us I will also pick again two cards for today, the 6th of September, 2019. And I hope they won't fly off <laughs> because I decided to be outside in the wind element today. Um, <clears throat> since it's very, very refreshing. Intuitively, I definitely pick up an excited energy today. An, an energy that um, invites us to be very, very flexible, to remain spontaneous, like a tree bending in the wind, not to be stiff and stubborn regarding various things in your life. Right, I shall pick two cards. I don't know if you can see, I'll try and get camera <laughs> crash here are the cards so um sorry for that that was very spontaneous <laughs> i guess just so that you know what i'm doing i shall pick two different cards from different decks and play with the pictures and the energies that these animals symbolize for me of course trans translated then into your life and up to you to interpret however you like and however it suits you most to at least let you gain more inspiration more clarity in regards to whatever you're facing today in your life at this moment in time so here we go <sighs> One of them, one of them. I also feel today, and I'll be very curious what animals come through today, that it's an energy that um, invites us also to laugh more. Remember to see the humor in every situation, no matter how harsh they may be. In fact, the more dramatic a situation is in life, the more is required from us to stay calm and centered but especially to not to lose that sense of humor uh, because I always like to say that humor will save the world so here we go oh interesting both from the water element today so this one came upside down which is the salmon and the water dragon I'm not sure if we had the water dragon recently but I can say it very much matches Ooh. the I hope you can hear me okay with the wind I don't know what effect it will have on the audio and on the um, microphone uh, basically emotional upheaval if you're feeling unsettled that confirms what I was saying earlier if you feel agitated, don't worry, it's part of the energies today. Uh, definitely confirms it with these two water cards. There is an urge. There is an urge if you today could ponder upon your roots, where you come from, um, the origins of earth, of human, uh, humanity, of, of your parents, of your birth country because the salmon is known to travel back all the way where it was born up the river even up the stream where then the other animals for example the bear which is also maybe an important medicine here today in order to um, gain our own power to own our feelings own our emotions own our life own our actions and take responsibility because responsibility doesn't mean anything else but be able to respond, response able, 
response abilities that we have. We all have them. I mean, the whole world could be in chaos all around us, but how we choose to respond to it is up to us. So bear in mind, bear in mind, to be uh, aware and cautious of the emotions that tend to go out of control. I mean, if you think about it, the emotions connected with the element of water, with the ocean, emotion, energy coming out of the ocean, out of our waters. And if we feel we go into untested waters or untested territory, be brave to be truthful to yourself. So if you feel like you have to jump in, you know, like when you go into cold water, into a lake or the sea, if you have to jump in, uh, go slowly, it might be much harder and a very painful procedure until you actually get to enjoy the dive into the water, even if it may be cold at first, and then you get used to it, to the temperature and so on. So just like that, as a parallel to life, if you jump into a situation prematurely, obviously it's not ideal, but if you don't see any other way to to go but just jump in forward then there the step and just be prepared to be open and to change any moment again even if it's a split of second that you realize no that was a bad idea okay turn around and change again so the ability to respond the ability to tune into our emotions with a more obje objective um, attitude and insight that helps us to gain distance and to not to get attached to the situation, to people, to feelings, to material goods, um, to others in the world or to simple things like uh, maybe even um, jealousy, greed, um, all these aspects that are also very, very human. I feel like I've got to hold the phone as well. <laughs> So if you fly off and see me from the distance, you know what happened. A very strong wind and it keeps changing as well. So it had, it rained as well here in England. But yes, this water dragon definitely says, I am powerful. I am so powerful. I can influence the whole ocean, you know, but I can also go everywhere to the deepest depth of my feelings with no fear because I'm part of it, because I'm part of the element of water. And apparently we are 70% made out of water and the earth is the same apparently. So I think we can gain a lot of wisdom from water. Um, again, listen to our intuition, be in touch with our emotional power and emotional intelligence. We all have it but we just don't um, handle it in the same way and what does it say here determination so you know where you're going and you will get there this is the message on the card from the salmon i also feel that it's inspiring to finish certain project that you started it inspires me also to because it came upside down <laughs> Maybe he's also saying that things are speeding up now. And you know, like in a on a ride, there's like the bumpy ride, the beginning can be bumpy and then it goes smoother and smoother. So make sure you keep your focus really, really, really strong on what you want to see happening, what your goal is. Even if it may change again, make sure you stay focused in this whole hurricane of that life may be throwing at you at the moment. Because if you stay focused, oh sorry, it's the other way around now. Um, when you're on a high speed in life, then obviously you can be thrown off center very, very easily. And then it's quite powerful impact to be thrown off of your tracks and whatever you're going. But staying flexible and still going really fast is almost like becoming empowered, self-empowered, and uh, listening to our intuition will help us to really define ourselves better, where we are, who we are, who we wanna be, and who we don't wanna be, where we don't wanna be. So 
knowing what we don't want helps us knowing what we do want or at least you know for sure that something is not it then go with it so trust it and believe in yourself thank you so much for listening i wish you an eventful yet smooth rest of the day namaste see you soon next time bye Mwah.